Eric here with Ham Radio Concepts. This is part two of the Bofeng GT5 TP. This is claimed to be an 8 watt handheld. This is available at radiodity.com. The link is in the description, R-A-D-I-O-D-D-I-T-Y. So, first video I did, I mentioned again, I didn't have a dummy load. What did I do? I bought a dummy load and it arrived today and I've already made two videos tonight. This is number three. I've never pumped out so many videos this fast since I've been doing this. So, MFJ894 cross needle power meter, MFJ264 dry dummy load, and the Bofeng GT5 TP. Let's turn this on to verify the battery voltage, if it shows. Frequency mode. It does not show, but I took it off the charger. It is uh, fully charged, and um, so what we're gonna do, mode. now that we're connected to a dummy load, I'm gonna test rate it. The One, center four, of the band. Six, zero, zero, zero. Here we go. GT5 TP. Just over six watts. Oh, about six watts. Six watts. Okay. Let's go down to one forty-two. Zero, zero, zero. Just over six watts. We'll go to one forty-eight. Oh, uh, getting closer to about six and a half, almost seven. We'll go to business One, band. Five, four, six, zero, zero. Okay, we're doing over seven. We'll go to the One, top end seven, of the transmitting four, spectrum zero, of this radio. Zero, 174. Zero. Just under six watts. How about 168? Eight, zero, zero, zero. Six. So we'll go to UHF 442.175, six watts. Now that is is impressive there because usually the uh, UV5Rs and GT3s are like three watts on UHF. So you're doubling your power there. Let's go to 447.000. Zero, zero, zero. That's about uh, just under five. Four. Four. Nine, zero, zero, zero. About five, we'll go to uh, 480, Four, which eight, is the top end zero, of the spectrum zero, you can transmit zero, on this radio. Zero. Four. Let's go down to four, uh, 400. Four, zero, zero, zero. Just under six. So. There is with what I'm concerned about is this right here, 146000. That's where I want to know where my power is, plus or minus two megahertz. You're getting six watts. Better than a UV5R? Yes. Uh, going from four to six watts is not that much of a significant increase. You, you want to double your power to make an increase. This is an eight watt handheld, I guarantee it for six. Bottom line. Uh, it is better on UHF than a UV5R, so that is a good thing. Usually UHF is a little bit lower power than um, than the uh, VHF. So that's part two with the dummy load. Check out part one if you're interested in a complete review of the radio. The radio is available at radiodity.com. There is a review on this, the power meter and the dummy load, and a lot more. So subscribe, check out my other videos, like and share on Facebook, and 7.3 from KJ4YZI.